The history of New York is a rich and dynamic story that spans centuries. From its beginnings as a small Dutch settlement to becoming one of the world's most iconic cities. Here's a concise overview of its development. New York's history begins with the Lenape Native Americans, who inhabited the region before European contact. In 1609, Englishman Henry Hudson, sailing for the Dutch East India Company, explored the area and claimed it for the Netherlands. By 1624, the Dutch established a fur trading post called New Amsterdam on Manhattan Island. In 1664, the English seized the settlement and renamed it New York in honor of the Duke of York, later King James II. During the 18th century, New York became an important trading hub due to its strategic location and natural harbor. The city played a crucial role in the American Revolution, both as a battleground and a British military headquarters. After the war, New York briefly served as the capital of the newly formed United States from 1785 to 1790. The 19th century saw rapid growth in New York. The opening of the Erie Canal in 1825 connected the city to the American interior, turning it into a major commercial and financial center. Immigrants, particularly from Ireland and Germany, poured into the city, swelling the population. By mid-century, New York was a bustling metropolis marked by the rise of industrialization. The construction of iconic buildings and burgeoning cultural institutions like the Metropolitan Museum of Art and Central Park. Although New York was a Union city during the Civil War, it was also home to divided loyalties and draft riots in 1863. After the war, the city experienced massive economic growth, becoming the nation's financial hub. The completion of the Brooklyn Bridge in 1883 and the Statue of Liberty in 1886 symbolized the city's progress and its role as a gateway for millions of immigrants arriving through Ellis Island. In the early 20th century, New York solidified its position as a world leader in finance, culture, and industry. Skyscrapers like the Empire State Building defined its skyline, while Wall Street became the global financial center. The city also became a cultural beacon, with Broadway, Harlem, and Greenwich Village playing central roles in the arts. The Great Depression hit the city hard, but it rebounded during World War II as a major manufacturing center. After the war, New York became the headquarters of the United Nations cementing its place in global diplomacy. However, the latter half of the century saw challenges such as suburban flight, economic downturns, and rising crime. Yet, by the 1990s, New York entered a period of revitalization, marked by falling crime rates and a booming economy.